Hey everyone, welcome back to another update for my unit game. So in this episode, we'll be focusing on collisions and also officers for units. So as you can see, this is our current collision system. Units kind of just bunch up together and they just attack whenever there's a collision. And I kind of want to change that. So here you can see the code that handles the collision process now. It checks whether if the collision is a friendly unit or an enemy unit. If it's an enemy unit, it attacks the enemy. If it's a friendly unit, it sends a message to the targeter where it adjusts its course away from the collision. And here's the result of the process. You can see the units going away from each other whenever there's a collision. It's still a little bit wonky, but it's much better than the previous system. Afterwards, I started working on the officers. I decided that officers would be given a bunch of units to command and whenever the officer moves, it will give orders to the other units. So here we have a formation and the formation basically is a vector that is added upon the officer's position. So the units will go to that position whenever an officer moves and it works something like this. So you see the units go in a very similar location. There are still a little bit of bugs present, one being the targeting code, where the enemies don't go to the unit's location. It's also one where if the unit is low health, it still is under the command, so the officer will be giving commands to a unit that doesn't exist. After fix the code, the end result looks something like this. The units quickly gather information and walks along with the officer. Thank you guys for watching yet another update. In the next update, I'll be working on redoing all the collisions because there's still a lot of bugs with it. Stay tuned for more updates and make sure to check out other episodes as well.